Ugh, I can't believe Ragnarok's crazy ex-girlfriend exiled me from the Viking clan. It's really lame being in exile, though, especially not having a home. What, what was that? Is somebody there? Hmm, I guess maybe it was just the wind. Maybe it was just my imagination. You know, I've been by myself for so long. Nope, that's definitely not my imagination. Come out and face the fierce huntress. I'm a talking human llama! Somebody, please! Somebody, please help me, por favor! Dyer, are you out here? Hey, what's going on? Oh my god, don't bring me back! I don't want to go back to the, to the laboratory, please! Laboratory? What laboratory? There were so many pointy things and they were... And, uh, now I'm attached to this llama! That thing? I am not a thing! I'm a living being! Okay? I'm Felix. Oh my god, it talks? That's quite the steed you got there. I'm not a steed. I am a yama. And you will respect me. Talk to me like that again and I'll deflate you. I'm sorry. Mm-hmm. Well, if you're not with the laboratory and you're not with those evil guys in there, then what are you doing way out here? My friend Dyer, he, he disappeared. He ran off and I couldn't just sit around doing nothing, so I... Uh, that's why I'm here. I just see nothing but a giant werewolf barge into the place and start murdering people. Oh, no. I gotta get in there and help them. The, the werewolf? The one that's eating people? Yeah, probably not a good idea. Oh, you don't understand. You're right. So I'm gonna leave this to you and I'm gonna get out of here. Bye. Wait, you can't leave me out here. Uh, yeah, yeah I can. So I'm probably just gonna do that. I need help. Please. Well, there's nothing you and I are going to do right now to stop a giant scary werewolf. Here, come with me and we'll go to the authorities and we'll, we'll find someone who can actually help. I don't know. He's in trouble right now. The cops might be in on it. Yeah, knowing them, they probably are. Look, I know some people who can help. Just come with me, all right? Well, okay. All right, Senor Yama, we're off. Giddy up. Stop it. Stop spanking me. Dar. I'm coming for you. And then I said, I don't like asparagus, but then they put asparagus on my plate anyway. I don't think they understand that the actual smell and taste of it sort of contaminates the other food on the plate. You know what I'm saying? I'll be honest. I've zoned out the last three miles you've been talking. That's fine. I'm really just talking for me at this point. I am here as well. Shut up, Steve. Wait, hold on a second. Why are we... I don't remember these cornfields being here. Oh, man, I'm so freaking lost. Why are they always changing the map? I think we're in Fatal Fields, actually. Well, that's a foreboding name. Oh, my God, look at that scarecrow. It's so freaky. I mean, it's not that scary. It's just a scarecrow. It literally is scare in its name. Yeah, that's for the birds, not you. I'm fragile. We have to hurry and find someone who can help us. Yeah, look, Calamity, if that's even your real name. Is it your real name? Yes. Worrying never solved anything. We need to stay calm and collected so that we can save your friend Dyer. All right? So just just stay calm. Don't freak out about, oh, my God, where'd the scarecrow go? Oh, my God, the scarecrow's gone. We're both going to die. Would you calm down? How am I supposed to calm down with this scarecrow? It's running off killing people. It probably just fell over. Why are you freaking out? I'm sorry. It's just the decorations around here are really spooky. Look, there's a ghost over there. Do you see what I put up with? Every day of my life is pain. Now, the two of you, I don't want to hear another word. Or the one of you's. We're going to go up there. We're going to knock on the door. And we're going to ask whoever lives there 
for some help. Okay, first you want to see the dance we've been practicing, though? Not particularly. I mean, we have been doing a lot of... We choreographed it and everything. I was hoping maybe you could... I'm, I'm just trying to find Dyer. And I'm in dire need of someone to see this dance. We're on a time crunch. Okay, I'm going to do it. Yeah, you got it. Be my leg, Senor Yaba. See, it takes two it takes two times the amount of work because he's we have to work I'm the upper half and he's the bottom half. Me and Dyer did that dance once. Yeah, well it's our dance now, so get over it. Okay, cool. Can we go now? Yeah, sure. Alright, let's see if anyone's home. I got this. Doc, doc. Who's there? Steven said you're Yama. Wait a minute, Steve? You're alive? Oh my god, Omega? I don't... Who is this? Oh my god, you're kidding. First Sunstrider, now you get Calamity? Dude, this is so not fair. I, I'm sorry, what's going on? You know what, I just might switch back to a default skin at this point. Clearly it's working. Omega, Senor Yaba fell in the lake and then I fell in the lake and then we morphed together and then we were captured and put in a secret laboratory and a werewolf came and then we had to escape and then I met up with Calamity and now we're here. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. So, uh, what do you want? I am evil and all that, so that's the whole thing. Yeah, but like, we go way back, so I was hoping maybe you could help me out. Okay, so what, what do you guys need? I need help to save Dyer. Well, I'm not doing that, so... Ah, oh, come on. Also, who is that? They're sort of new around here. I've lived here for ten years. Due to the storyline. Alright, well, I'm not gonna help you with your, uh, boyfriend problems, but... But, you guys can stay the night here. Just make sure that you stay out of the fields. Why did you say that like that? What, what does that mean? As you know, Steve, my father and his father owned this farm before me. A curse was put on the land. It's a really long story. I don't want to get into it, but basically just don't go in the cornfields. Uh, okay, I think we can manage that. What's wrong with the cornfields? They seemed fine when we were passing through before. Just take my word for it. Don't go in the cornfields. What if we were just passing by to the side of the cornfield? Did you, did you look in the cornfields? Yeah. Oh, God. Just get in here. Leave it to Steve to screw things up. We're all gonna die. Ah, uh, nothing like a log day. Time to get some rest and... Wait, what? what is that? What? Oh my god. Oh, oh my god! Uh, somebody! Somebody! What, 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 what is it? <laughs> what Steve is trying to say is there is a walking scarecrow outside. What? I don't know, ask him. Yeah, it was, it was, it got out, and then it walked across the cornfield and- Steve, you're probably just seeing things. I don't know, Omega was oddly specific about the cornfield and something being wrong with it and a curse on the land. He was probably just being dramatic. And now that there's me and the llama, there's two people who saw this thing. Actually, my eyes do not see over the windowsill, but- See? You just need a good night's rest. No! Oh, oh my god! What was that? I told you, it's blood. Actually, I think that was a tomato. All right, that's it. We're going out there and we're going to figure out what's going on. Okay, but but I, I don't like this idea. What are you guys doing? Oh my God, there's a scarecrow outside. It came to life. I suppose you know them. What are you talking about? You tell us what's going on right now. You see, before my family took over this ranch. There was a tribe of tomato heads on this land. They pillaged and killed all of them. But not before the tomato heads put a curse. Basically, any food we grow here comes to life and... And then, uh, something with a scarecrow? Honestly, I never listened when my dad told the story, but it's bad. So, so you're saying that- Yeah, the scarecrows come to life here and they really cause havoc. We usually just shoot them, but I mean- I'm not buying this, I'm going out there! I, I, uh, that's not a- Whatever. Your funeral. Calamity, this really isn't a good idea. Steve, you'll never get anywhere in life by being a coward. I beg to differ. I've been doing just fine. Come on. Yeah, that's really cool, though, but, like, maybe we should just not be in the cornfield. Remember how Omega said one thing was to just not go into the cornfield? Steve, shut up. How did you know everyone says that to me?
Wait a minute. Hold on. Weren't we just over there and now we're over here? Where's the exit to this place? I ain't waiting for you, Steve! Wait, Gwebity, don't, don't go to head it. Oh, well, howdy, partners. Yeah! Oh. Wait, why are you yelling? Uh, all that yelling, I, I'm not I'm not used to loud noises around this box. Wait, you're what you're not killing guys. No, 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 why would I do a thing like that, little little llama noob idiot? Or whatever you are. Is that what spooky scarecrows do? They kill people? Now that is a gross mischaracterization of a whole species of, fi of fellas, so I, I wish you wouldn't do that. Sorry. Well, that's all right. I told you, Steve. But why were you, and then you disappeared and you walked around and then, well, I guess actually you didn't really do anything wrong. Yeah, I, I just saw you guys wandering around the corn, looked like you were lost. So I was just going to come on over and help you out, help you got get on out of this maze here. Wow, I'm so glad to know that scarecrows aren't aggressive towards anyone. Now, I never said that. My brother, Cletus, he would have killed you right, right away. He would have just stabbed you right in the face. It's a good thing you didn't run into him out here. Oh, 